Well, good morning, everybody. This is Rock and Spirit Jen bringing you two essential oils today. What do I have in my essential oil necklace diffuser? But Leadum. Leadum contains cleansing properties, may help support healthy weight management, supports a healthy digestive system, and supports healthy endocrine system. And as a woman, you know, we blow uh, like the wind. Um, we're all over the place because of the nature and dynamic of a woman's hormonal system. It's very, very sensitive. The endocrine system needs to be a finely tuned and running machine. Um, and there's so many things that we do on a day-to-day -day lifestyle basis and in our environment that throw our endocrine system off. I mean, simply going to the grocery store and taking that receipt that every cashier person wants to place in your hand directly on your skin their endocrine disruptors in the ink setting component on that receipt so there's a powder that actually goes right on the ink that quick dries and sets that ink but guess what when you get that in your hand your skin uptakes okay it is a huge organ for uptake so you have to be very careful what goes on the skin well unfortunately when we handle one, two, three, four receipts in a day, we are wreaking havoc on our endocrine system because of the hormone disruptors and the endocrine disruptor elements of that receipt. And that's just one thing that you probably don't even know about, but it, we are laden with many endocrine disruptors in our life. So to have an essential oil on your side that supports a healthy endocrine system and balance, that you know your endocrine system is really everything it sets the tempo and mode for your constitution your emotional and physical well-being uh, if your endocrine system's off you get sick more um, you're in more pain you're more emotional and there's just so many things that are tied in to that endocrine system so this is a powerhouse of an essential oil to use on a regular basis and certainly for somebody that struggles with endocrine system imbalances now cystus, now this is coined as a rock and rose, um, it contains elevating properties, promotes feelings of relaxation, supports a healthy immune system, and supports a healthy nervous system. And cystus has been spoken of in scripture, and uh, I think anything in scripture is something to be um, sought out discovered gain knowledge and put it into practice because it's in there for a reason because it's very beneficial to God's design and his people so both of these are aromatic and topical so uh, you can put them in your body care you can put them in massage hand creams whatever you want to do with the topical administration and then you can put it in your diffuser necklaces uh, put it in your house diffuser uh, spritz, spritzer bottle for the car put it on your dryer balls I will often load my dryer balls up I do not use conventional dryer sheets why? Because there's so many endocrine disruptors, cancer-causing components in the, the false fragrance and the additives and everything else that goes along with those. It's one of the most toxic things in a household that we use on a regular basis. And the thing is, is with dryer sheets, think about it. You're putting your clothes in the dryer. They're getting coated with this fake, false, softening agents and fragrances. And what does that do? Those clothes are on us or we sleep on them. So we're they're with us 24 hours a day. So we never get away from them. So things that you're exposed to on a 24 hour basis, clothing, bedding, jackets, blankets, pillows, you wanna make sure that you are cleaning those daily worn and used products, your bath towels, everything that you use consistently every day with very, very pure ingredients. And so, man, I ditched those dryer sheets. First, I graduated from no smell I mean, from fragrance dryer sheets to no smell dryer sheets to dryer sheets are gone. They're history. I use the woolly balls that help to fluff up the fabric. I put essential oils on those so it makes the fabric smell really nice. Um, helps with some of the static cling. Uh, so, I mean, they're phenomenal. I've been using dryer balls now for probably four or five years, six years. Love them. Uh, I stopped using laundry detergent um, probably close to a year now. Um, maybe six months. I use these magnetic um, 
devices that go right into your washing machine. They cling on the wall and what they do is they change the surface tension of the water, which is exactly what laundry soap does. It just changes the surface tension of the water. It's not what's actually cleaning your clothes. It's changing the tension of the water so the water can lift things out of your clothing. Well, you don't need chemicals and fragrance to do that. You just need something that changes that surface tension. So you want to have really clean, fresh smelling clothes that don't smell like anything that's been coated on them. Use those magnetic uh, laundry alternatives. And um, if you want to put a little bit of treatment, like uh, let's say some doTERRA on guard or some other brand of natural essential oil, biodegradable, non-toxic soaps, like maybe a Castile soap base, then you can put a little bit on that. But just anything that you add to your laundry is going to coat your laundry. And the coating of the laundry by things such as uh, soaps and everything, they actually um, deteriorate, deteriorate the integrity of the fabric threads. So your clothes aren't going to last as long. They're going to get dingy and hold on to uh, more dirt and soil and smells that are just never really going to come out. Um, you want to know that you're getting your clothes clean. How do you know that? It's by using things that are not fragranced then you can actually smell your clothes. Okay, do they smell like something? Do they feel grimy still when they're coming out? Take all that away and you'll know when you have clean clothes because the water is all that needs to do it. Just like with cleansing the body. Hey, I don't use body wash. Okay, because warm water and friction gets off anything that's on your body. Why strip your bodies of the necessary oils that's the barrier of protection in your skin, keeping it supple and moist, and it is a barrier against pathogens and bacteria and things coming in through your skin. So I want healthy skin, so I'm not gonna use soap and strip that away. Then I just have to apply more toxic things onto my skin or lots of oils to combat the dryness that I've created. So I'll just wash my body with water every now and again if I absolutely need it. If I'm not eating well and I might feel like I have maybe some funky smell going on, I might just use some body wash directly under the armpits or the private places of the body, but that is it. I don't want to change the balance and the bacteria levels that are good for my body, even down below, ladies. You don't want to cover uh, all your natural bacteria and kill them all off with a bunch of... Uh, antibacterial washes because then you're going to smell worse and more bacteria are going to come. You're not going to solve the problem. You want to leave your good healthy flora there. And uh, so you just take care of it. And so what I'll do is after I shower, I'll put a little bit of coconut oil right directly on my skin in the shower. That helps to hold the moisture in longer. It's great for the skin. Got a lot of great properties in uh, coconut oil. So um, I know that's a lot of different information along the board, but that's I'm here to tell you all areas of life, not just one topic, but I'll just walk you through and educate you on how you can uh, take your health level up and how you can better serve your family and your body and other friends that you can share with. So got my headband on, getting ready to do a little opportunity for those who subscribe to my uh, mailing list for my Rock and Spirit creations and uh, you can get yourself a special little headband like this and uh, just pay for the shipping and I'm happy to introduce a product to you that way and get you coming uh, to my newsletter uh, email subscription list every day so you can get good great quality information and tips to make your life a better place uh, and your world a better place so I'll tell you some more about these headbands when I actually launch that off. I've been fine-tuning the website, staying up late hours, trying to get all my products posted. I've got dozens of products I still need to get on there. And, uh, and then I'll give you a big shout out. Hey, today's the day. Go there, get your headband, go subscribe today. It's my opening, grand opening. Get yourself a headband just for a low, low shipping handling fee. Um, and then you can rock your day and your outfit and your, uh, whatever you do out there in the world uh, with a nice well-kept uh, hair in place. This is also keeps my thoughts in my brain. <laughs> That's just a joke. Anyway, I'll see you tomorrow. Like and share the video.